Um, yeah, we're good? Okay. Yeah. Mr. Pellegrini, here, yes. we, here, here we are again uh, with another episode. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm, moving, I'm looking forward to your show and tell items today. And, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, well, I'll start right away because mm -hmm. the exciting thing was uh, the fact that I found one item today uh, and then later in, in putzing around uh, doing some other work, I found something that's related. So I'll start with these two uh, of the four that I plan to show. Cool. Uh, here is number one. Mm. Uh, this is quite emotional. Uh, I mean, it may not be for you, <laughs> but it is for me. I'll, I'll steady myself okay. now. Let's now. go back in time. It's 1950. Mm. Okay, so I'm five years old. Grandpa, my mom's dad, comes back from a visit to Italy to his hometown of Genoa mm. and uh, brings me a gift which he hands to my little five-year-old hands, and I'm going to show you what they are. Oh, my are. goodness. Oh, how precious. These are handmade oh in Genoa by what is called the cobbler. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. And, and uh, they were never worn because my mother said <laughs> they're feminine. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, she said, Mom said what they're, they're, they're too nice. <laughs> So, so, uh, Cucciola. Yeah, yeah Cucciola, is, Cucciola is the brand name of the maker, and I think they're precious. They're as so hell. beautiful. And, so cute. Uh, oh my God. I never wore them, and of course, now they're, they're it's a real tight fit. <laughs> so, so I have And this is 20? Is this 20 is the size for children. Yeah. Were they, would they have fit? Did you ever try them on when you were little? Uh, I probably did, yeah. but then mom said, no, no, no save them for so Sunday. Or, I, I love how, yeah. like, how immaculate they, they really are. Yeah, this yeah. is really something special. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Those old guys over there would lose their mind. Yeah. Which is just precious. Oh my gosh. That's really... Isn't that something? It really is. And, and they didn't have heels for kids because they, I found out later, talking to a, a shoeman, that there's no need for a kid to have a heel uh, because their their foot is totally even at that age. They don't have a big arch. Oh, uh -huh. that develops later. Yeah. Huh. So I, they I walk, never thought about they that. They walk in flat shoes. Wow. In, you know, the first years of life. They're so beautiful. Isn't that cool? Yeah, now, it's, it's now, really adorable. now Thank we're going to see. Yeah. yeah. Some, yeah. Sometimes I see them and actually get teary eyed. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I was almost there myself and I wow. thought, get it together. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now. Part two that goes with this uh, is uh, the related part. Ah, okay. So I'm uh, in an entirely different area of the house, uh, in the basement, and I run into this, which was made for me by a neighbor. This was made probably about 1960. Wow. And it's a wooden carved shoe. Oh, just, wow. just the one. He wow. never got around to the second. But this was a neighbor. One left foot was enough. Uh, yeah, the Italian neighbor who saw the little shoes yeah. and said, "Oh, I, I will carve one for you." Wow. That's this is so. Yeah. Cool. What, a, what a story. It's so yeah. Here. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And I love the like the yeah, it, all the little details. It, it's got the um, and, and the seams uh -huh. that he put in with those dots. Yeah. Oh my God. And again, the flatness. You see. Yeah. Right. It's right. Got, right. Very serious heel. Yeah, no, it's, it's like the details are really deliberate. Every yeah. little detail. That's so. Oh, can, that's, that's can lovely. Get that on screen now? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Only yeah. Of course. And that's wow. Okay. Oh, and, I, and I can take. I can try to take a picture. Yeah. 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 Sure. So those are one and two, and um, very cool. Uh, now I'm going to go into uh, the realm of Germany. And one inspired by the other too. One inspired by the other. That's exactly really. That's right. really. That's really special. Exactly. Wow. Right. That's so interesting. And there's something. Oh gosh, there's something really poignant about. Like this, 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 like this little shoe with this tiny little right, right. Person, you know? Anything diminutive, yeah. 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 We talked about this. Yeah. Uh, it's especially precious, I think. Yeah. Um, and that's why kids' toys, which are of course huh. made for little kids, yeah. uh, have that dimension of huh. tininess. Uh -huh. Right. Yeah. right. Yeah. The, and the and little hands. And the yeah, yeah. Yeah. To me, it's very charming. And for yeah. example, dollhouse furniture yeah. is mm -hmm. all very, very small to allow. Uh, Child to have rooms full of furniture. Yeah. Right, right. Uh, so, right. Um, so now we go to Germany, and we meet the Solingen knife people. The Solingen knife people are, like most Germans, uh, into meticulous craftsmanship. 
Mm. And they work a lot with uh, doing corns with deer, moose, and elk. Mm. Uh, mm. This is, again, an old, old knife that was given as a gift. And it's made with elk horn. Wow. But wait, the real feature <laughs> is cards. <laughs> 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 oh my goodness. Who has stuff like that? Sir Alex. Sir Alex. <laughs> Man, yeah, accept those substitutions. So there's a yeah. really good steel. It comes from, uh, from Germany and Austria. Yeah, yeah. But the elk horn is really yeah. strong. Yeah, wow. Well, and, and this yeah. goes back to the, the Norse yeah. and the Vikings mm -hmm. who, had, who used animal horns for their swords, mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. their uh, daggers. As, as handles for the blades, right? Yeah. Right, wow. And even their cutlery. Well, oh, I love how the, the like the, the shape of the horn is important. It's made from the beard yeah. of the yeah, yeah, face. Yeah. And, wow. Wow. Really, Elizabeth really special. Wow. Yeah, right. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. Is that charming or what? <laughs> but it, it has this really ancient, you know. Yes. Yeah. 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 And the facial expression is just like so particular. It's quite different from the women we met last week from Peru. Oh, right. right Oops. Right, yeah. I think oh, this, this is a very, it's a very serious guy yeah. we're looking at here. Do you have a name for him? Uh, I, I don't yet, but we're, we're certainly uh, capable amongst the three of us. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, Thor? Well, but, no. but, but, that's, but I think that's veering the German, yeah, Germanic yeah, aspect yeah. of it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I have a hard yeah. time getting this into focus on the camera. I sure, we can, we can do it. How about considering uh, in your ballads, if, if you come up with it? I, I, that's, that's a good idea. A challenge accepted. Okay, okay. Yeah. And finally, not to be uh, outdone here. Uh, <laughs> I've done it only by yourself. So. <laughs> uh, where's my last one? Uh, here it is. Oh boy. <laughs> a, Par a Parisian uh, pillbox. And when I got this, uh, it was at an estate sale. And I opened it up. It's a French poisoné. Mm. Oh, wow. it's a very, very hard thing to do. The colors are picked and then they're baked. And unless you know what you're doing, uh, the baking of the colors will run into other mm -hmm. areas. Oh, it'll bleed over. Yeah. It'll bleed over. Huh. So this, this is a consummate uh, master. So it's, it's baked? Uh, it, it's baked and cooked. And the whole, wow. the whole thing, is, it's an enameling process. Okay. So when I opened it up, yeah. I was expecting, I knew it was a pillbox. What I did know is that somebody would have uh, a little uh, little cube that says again, <laughs> and a tiny little purse, a silver purse huh. with, a, with a cat face on it. Like Hello Kitty? Yeah. Oh, this is a Hello Kitty. Yeah, Hello yeah. Kitty. Yeah. So that uh, is that, really... I'm sure that was put in much later than the creation quite, of the box. Quite, quite certainly, yeah. But with a juxtaposition right. of a Hello Kitty purse again. inside of a... Well, it's this even more, I think, because the, yeah, yeah. the branding of this is very specific and very sure. infantilizing. But again, of all words, I mean, that's interesting choice. Yeah, that's really loaded, isn't it? Just the word again. And again, you want to photograph that. My good, wow, no, this is really... I love the cool. closeness that you've brought. It's going to be hard to find faith in favor or something. I think so, too. Please. Well, that's, that's really beautiful. I mean, it's, I mean, it's stunning. Something you don't run into. Oh no, no, I, I don't think I've. Yeah. It's like a, it's like a lock you can make. Uh, yes, it's, it's for. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's oh, and this too. Person. Is it? Yeah. Oh. Oh, I didn't even see that. Huh. Makes me very intrigued. Actually, it's not a question. I, I made it sound as if again. <laughs> Actually, again. I think yeah, yeah. I didn't take it to be a question either. I oh, took okay. it to be like. Reflecting on, well, it, like, like I said, makes it invites reflection on sure. the repetitive kind of. Well, that's it's such a loaded word again. Uh, let yeah. me be sure to give you balance. Maybe they just forgot the space, and it's supposed to be a game. Uh, <laughs> typo. Uh, for our listeners. Mm. Thank you. Yep. Great jazz. Very cool. Wonderful. Thank yeah. you, Ralph. Yeah. Really. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. When so they all have this. Well, actually, with the exception of the knife handle, I think the, the shoes in the box have this 
like a diminutive uh -huh. quality. And, yeah. especially, and, and that tiny little Hello Kitty thing inside of the box. So the, I, the idea that there were contents at all. Yeah. And, and that those were the contents. Very and, mysterious. And, and yes, and why, why those? Right, right, right. Uh, right. What, what a funny juxtaposition. Why not have, for example, I wasn't listening to like Uh huh. It has scent. Oh, sachets? Sachet? Sachet? Yeah. How do you pronounce sachet. it? Yeah, sachet. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the girl with sachet. <laughs> like S A C H E T. Yeah. Yeah. So, anyway, that's, that's what I expected to find some kind of. Yeah. Mm. Or old bills <laughs> left. You know. Yeah. Right. Right. Look. That was a, there was a use, uh, the use was a, a very uh, affluent lady would have, it was essential for, she, for her to have that in her purse, mm. you know, not just ordinary pill box, but something really mm -hmm. special. Yeah. And, uh, like a cigarette case. Like a, yeah, with a cigarette yeah. case. Yeah. Mm. All right. Uh, okay. We done? Good. Well, then with that, we can take a break.